Hey guys, Justin here. We are live at a house tour in Ewing, New Jersey. We're with about 30 investors, all checking out this house and four others. So we've got a big old school bus full of people here checking everything out. I'm gonna give you a quick tour and uh, bring you into the conversation. Let's go. Something, I forgot your name. Um, Carmen. Carmen. Now here's something we look for. So we see that, so you say, oh, there's gas in the house. And let's just say there is. So nobody puts in an electric dryer if there's gas in the house. Mm. Yeah. So right, if I see that in an older home, the first thing I'm thinking of is there could be an oil tank. Because if there is an oil tank and it was oil, then you have to have electric. Then I go upstairs and see if there's an electric stove. If you have an electric stove and electric dryer, mm -hmm. chances are it was oil at some point. Oh, okay. And then they convert it to gas. Mm -hmm. Hey, Paul, what is radon and what does it mean to mitigate it? Yeah, radon is a naturally occurring gas that comes from the decomposition of rock. And it gets into the homes, and if you breathe enough of it over a long period of time, it causes lung cancer. And that's no ifs, ands, or buts. That's so what are you supposed to do about it? So you put in a what they call a sub-slab suction system. Okay. Alright, got it out. Yeah. Um, yeah, so they go underneath, this pipe goes underneath, they put a fan on it somewhere along the pipe, and they suck all the radon gas and they send it up above the house. So that's what that is? Yeah. And is there any way to know if it's working properly? It's well, yes. Right now. If it's on, then this, this is a manometer. Okay. And it's, it doesn't look like it's working properly. There's, so, uh, there's paper in the top of the pipe outside. Yeah. So what should we be looking so for? So one side of this should be much higher than the other side. Okay. Which is that telling means you pushing that it's it out. negative pressure. So okay. there's negative pressure in here. Right. Much like the fan in your in your kitchen that sucks all the air out of your kitchen. Got it. Um, it's doing the same thing. It's creating negative pressure underneath the slab. It's taking whatever gas is underneath the slab and getting rid of it. Okay. Some kind of mold. Oh. Is that... Yeah, it's comes. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, yeah. It's got to be attached to something secure. It can't be near a water source, and it's got to be stapled within the first 12 inches of the box. Okay. The fact that it's this way versus yeah. it's not really. Yeah. No. You can't. You can't mount it flush to a floor. Paul, we had a question about yeah. mold. Yeah. How do you tell, and what do you do, and is it a big well, deal? Yeah. Obviously, we got some mold here. Um, no, I, personally, I've been doing this a long time. Uh, mold is the new asbestos. What does yeah. that mean? It means that years ago you said the word asbestos. Yeah. People would flee for their lives. Yeah. Yeah. Flee! Right. They would. Now you say mold and they flee for their lives. <laughs> yeah. No one cares about asbestos anymore. <laughs> they saw Katrina down in New Orleans and everyone got nuts. Now we are not below sea level. We do have four seasons. So, um, but, you know, if you have sensitivities, asthma, kids with asthma, young kids that have, you know, pulmonary problems, premature births. Yeah, it's a, it's a real deal, don't get me wrong. Um, but, um, you know, it's the same like radon. You find it, you fix it. Okay. And they have professionals that come in and do a nice job. And they get... side of the wall. Okay. If you have them, now this property doesn't have them, but if you had them, and let's say you do, then you go to the opposite side, you go to the opposite corner, and you look for the mirror image of that crack. Mm -hmm. If you see it, so if you see the crack going like this over here, and then on that wall it's going this way, Watch. run from the house. <laughs> right. Don't walk, run. Right. Right. Because that means that the foundation has rotated off its found uh, off its footers. Oh. Oh. Release. <laughs>
saying that that loan had been paid off. It took them, they did, but it took me two months longer to close, and I was not about to close. I couldn't close. My title, well, title company would not give me title insurance with that lien on there, so it took an extra two months. So sometimes people say, well, I'm paying cash. I don't need title insurance. You'd be, I'll be nice, you would be unwise. You would be foolish.